Hello guys, so uh, just want to make a quick video on how to install POB fork onto your normal POB. So the feature of a POB is that POB fork is that you are able to calculate impure damage. You are able to calculate things that normal POB doesn't like um, barrage impure. It has a bit more in depth um, things compared to normal POB. So I really recommend POB fork because. Um, it really helps a lot to show those uh, DPS that otherwise wouldn't really show. So in order to download POB fork, you must download the normal POB first. So after download P normal POB, you search POB fork, right? POB fork. You go to um, GitHub.com, then you click download, zip or whatever, extract, put it into a computer, right? Afterwards, there's an instruction here which I'll link it in the description down below. Okay, but so after you download extract POB fork, the thing that you wanna do is go to this PC, go to the place where you have your normal POB. So you wanna go to um at least my HD, okay, HDD hard drive, hard disk. After you go here, you wanna select um let me see. There's a button where you can um, see things, view, then you can click on um, view hidden items, okay? So originally there wasn't any, uh, I, I think for normal people, right, this wasn't tick. So after you, if you want to go to the program data, which we, are, we need to go to, right, you have to go to your hard disk, you click view over here, you click you need to tick your hidden items and then you're able to see program data here okay then you double click program data you'll find path of building which you can just search here path path of building after you go here you want to find uh, this file called uh, manifest right manifest you want to right click open with then open with notepad so after opening notepad, you will see a bunch of words like this. So this is where the image from Imgu is really useful. Okay, so it says here that um, if your first line is like this, right? It's like this. So meaning if your first line matches the description here, then you want to... Then you want to change to this word over here. So if your line for this one looks like this, like the first line here looks like this, you change to this. If your, there's two layout, right? And But if your line look like this on the, like on the fifth sentence, then you change accordingly to this. Right. It has the instruction there. So you just look. So if the lines looks like this, you change according to the first one. You just copy and paste. Control C, Control V. There's another layout. If it doesn't match, then look at this. Sentence 5. It, my one, I think, is a uh, sentence 5. My one is sentence 5, yeah. Everyone has different ones. Some people are layout 1, some are layout 2. Just copy paste and you should be fine. Remember to save the file. Then you can use a uh, POB fork. After you save the file, you open normal POB, right? Normal po um, open the path of building. Then there will be an update. After the update, you can use your the features of POB fork. It will say like uh, checking update, then you update the POB, then you can you can calculate your impure damage. So I think it's very useful for you to download um, POB fork. There's a lot of things like when you're using barrage or using like uh, elemental heat, you're using impure. Those things doesn't calculate into the normal POB. So it's also not very difficult to download. The POB fork, so just download them and easier to um, create builds and to see your damage. You know, hope this build has been helpful to you. And uh, I'll be streaming 
some random games PC my new PC is coming soon tomorrow actually so just stream some random games Wilson is like shit game okay so stream some random games then maybe like wait for um PoE PoE is fucking best game anyway hope you guys enjoy see you guys in the next one